This is the Starbucks drive through line at 10 a.m. Yes, I'm going to stay in the line because I don't want to get out like everybody else. So it's Saturday and this is the day that actually I don't like work really hard, but I start to put my outfits together. So here's a possibility for striped joggers are really big. So here's a possibility for this week. Just simple black and white. It's really cold outside, so I have a cashmere striped sweater on. But and these uh, actually these striped joggers are old from Ann Taylor. Well, I'll give you a bird's eye view. So this is really kind of how I start to set things up. I usually get one key piece. I've really been loving this anthropology. Um, what do they call it? Wonderland. I think this is, this jacket is. It's an embroidered jacket. Has some beautiful details on it. I've already worn it with a cashmere dress, turtleneck dress, and so now I'm thinking of putting it with a pussy bow blouse, which is very classic and um, it's a staple of mine. And then here's another fun outfit for a future collab that I'm working with, I mean working on. So it's just a simple black dress. The key pieces aren't here yet, but that's what I'm going to wear when they come. And then here's me. I've been kind of fooling around with plum eyeshadows a little bit. And I added a pink. I don't know if you can see it. I'm not the best. Um, I'm not the beauty blogger. I'm the style blogger, but I try to do my best with beauty. And I do try to experiment a little bit. So this is my, this is my latest attempt at some um, winter plum looks. And Mr. Style and I are going to head off to Target in a little bit. I'm going to brave it on a Saturday. Call me crazy. Uh, but we need a couple of things. And, I'm, and we we're headed up to Atlanta on Monday. Kind of have a busy week. So it's like, ugh, just get my errands out of the way. And I uh, might have a sneak peek of my youngest child. Sometimes he tags along with this. I have one that lives here in Athens with us. I'm super lucky about that. But, um, but anyway, Target later today. And that's my all-time favorite store. It has been since the 80s when we lived in Minnesota. And that's actually, for those of you who are not familiar with Target, that's that's where they originated. It was uh, in the Twin Cities. And Dayton Hudson actually owned them. And when we lived there, I had a Dayton Hudson card for my, you know, uh, the retail card. And I could use that at Target. Then we moved to Texas. I tried to use it one time. And they were like, um, oh, what are you doing, lady? We don't we do not do this. So it was, it was kind of cute. Uh, but now Target's in so many places. But I, ha I have a lot of... Uh, um, viewers from different countries so for those of you who are not familiar with target it's it's just a it's a big uh store that sells clothes and groceries and electronics and you know pet food i mean you name it target really really carries it and and as far as clothes it's a it's a very very affordable budget friendly uh, clothing items is, is what they offer and they always have cute stuff well this is where we ended up eating on a very cold wintry day, De Palma's, a pasta, yes, I had a glass of Cabernet, Mr. Style joined me, and he just loves being on camera, and then uh, this is just a, it's a very popular restaurant here in Athens, great pizza, pasta, very old school, but perfect for a cold winter day, don't you think? doing some Christmas shopping, as you can see, at Target. So I'm going to pan around. And this guy actually belongs to me. This is Christian. This is my youngest. Hello. Christian, what are you going to do today at Target? I'm going to be doing some Christmas shopping for Christmas my family. Christmas shopping for me? For you, you and for get? my brothers. I don't know. I want to know what you're no. getting me for have Christmas. You been, have you been bad or have you been good? So. I think I've been pretty nice. Well, there we go. Well, yeah, so I think I, I think I, I think I need a good present, don't you think? I think so. Okay. All right. <laughs> Chatty Kathy over there. Anyway, so here's again a panoramic of Target. My favorite store for 30 years in Camden. Oh, there's Mr. Style. He found something. What'd you find? A hat? Yeah, that's for women, but oh, you but... can get it, but I would wear it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I also need to find a children's book at my book club this month. We are having an ornament exchange, but we're each bringing one book to donate to the uh, Toys for Tot drive. So, I don't know. Which one should I get? Should I get a Christmas book or should I just get a regular book for the kiddos? 
So I'm making a stop in the Christmas department. Just give you a little 360 here. You see all the red and green. There's some fun things. Advent calendar. As I said, this is a store that has everything that you could want. So this is what I ended up coming home with from Target. So I'm all set for my uh, books for the um, Salvation Army Toys for Tots. So I got, actually I got three. So I have Dr. Seuss, Oh, The Places You'll Go. I love that book. Charlotte's Web for a little bit of an older reader. And then Green Eggs and Ham, which is, was another favorite of my kiddos. So uh, I'm gonna switch the camera around slowly. Hold on. So that was my day. That was my Vlogmas day. Just a typical day, Saturday. Uh, got a little bit of work done, a little bit of errands done, and froze my fanny off because, as I said, it's really cold and rainy. And now we're going to watch, we're going to binge watch season two of The Marvelous Miss Maisel. If you haven't seen that uh, that show, it's on Netflix. Uh, there's uh, season one, they just released season two. So uh, that's my night. So I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.